the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Come, Holy Spirit, by the powerful intercession of Mother Mary, your world beloved spouse. Come, Holy Spirit, by the powerful intercession of Mother Mary, your world beloved spouse. Come, Holy Spirit, by the powerful intercession of Mother Mary, your world beloved spouse. Come, Holy Spirit, by the powerful intercession of Mother Mary, your world beloved spouse. Pray this rosary, especially in honor of Saint Joseph. The, the foster, the stepfather of our Lord and Saviour Jesus Christ, the husband of the Blessed Virgin Mary. It is said by many experts that Saint Joseph, after the Blessed Lady Mary, the mother of Jesus, is the greatest of saints. And it is said that after the Blessed Virgin Mary, if we turn to Joseph, pretty much of any worry, any trouble, any concern, any petition, that he will bring this before Jesus for us. And if it is God's will, then the Lord will answer that prayer. How can the Lord Jesus turn down Saint Joseph, his stepfather, he who held the little child Jesus in his arms, he who showed the little child Jesus how to make and make um, uh, carvings and fix roofs and all kinds of practical and physical things in the trade work of carpentry. And I'm sure he would have shown him many things to do with that trade, which I'm sure back in that time, in, uh, 2,000 years ago, carpentry would have involved a lot of things, not just making, you know, wooden objects. It would have involved fixing, you know, and uh, fixing houses and fixing doors and making um, utensils and all sorts of um, um, devices and aspects of his job. And he would have been there with the little Lord Jesus. And as we all know, the, the scripture says it, our Lord, he didn't actually go into public ministry until he was 30 years of age. Where was he before that? Of course, he was with the Blessed Virgin Mary and St. Joseph. Obviously, as we see in the scripture, when the Lord was a man, St. Joseph wasn't around because he had died by this stage. But what a wonderful gift St. Joseph is to us. The just man, the good man. A man who responded always to the promptings of our, of our Lord. When the angel told him, get up and go, Joseph got up and went. When the angel told him, take this woman as your wife, he did exactly what he was told by the Lord. Never once do we see in scripture St. Joseph refusing to do God's will. We don't even hear him respond to the angel. He just does it. Oh, if only we had such obedient hearts as St. Joseph to the will of God. If only we had such trust in God as St. Joseph does. Even when he doesn't understand, he, he did God's will. And this same St. Joseph, this protector, imagine that, a, a mortal man. He was a protector of God himself. In the person of Jesus Christ, the second person of the Holy Trinity. And if Lord Jesus Christ, our King of Kings, Lord of Lords, chose Joseph among all men, among all generations, to be his stepfather, as be it when he is a little child, then who are we to not ask for him for help? Or how we should go to St. Joseph. For us men, that we may be men, husbands, fathers, priests, religious, as God has called us to be. For women, that they may see in St. Joseph a father, he, a brother, someone to ask when seeking a holy husband, a protector, 
of and also an archetype of what a man should be. For did not Jesus himself choose Saint Joseph to be his stepfather? And also in a mystical, mysterious way, how he must have resembled God the Father himself in some mystical way, though Joseph was truly and and solely a man. What a humble and beautiful, wonderful man Saint Joseph was, is, and is now before our Lord and Saviour Jesus Christ in heaven. Let us turn and ask him to intercede for us and also go to the Blessed Virgin Mary. You can imagine his humble and quiet and courageous ways. And when he asked the Blessed Virgin Mary to speak to her son on our behalf, how could Our Lady refuse Joseph, he who loved her so much and protected her and the Holy Family? I ask you now just to add your intentions, whatever they may be. And you can always pause this video if you wish to add more. And I ask you to bring up any intention that you have. For we shall not fear that St. Joseph will bring this attention, this intention before God. Again, you know, God will listen to his, his prayers for us and his petitions for us before him. Again, God does what he wants because he is God. And if he is good for our soul and the souls of others, then surely the Lord will answer that prayer. I pray this also for my beautiful wife. Um, she's been going through a bit of a rough time recently, and uh, last year or so, I pray for a complete and total healing, physically, mentally, emotionally, spiritually, by the power of the Holy Spirit in Jesus Christ's name, and especially for Saint Joseph's mighty intercession, that he may intercede for my wife for my little children and for my family. He may seek powerfully and all our concerns and worries. And Saint Joseph, you know what my concerns and my worries are. And they offer all of them to you, Saint Joseph, and the Blessed Virgin Mary, as you stand before our Lord and Saviour Jesus Christ. And I ask for my guide and angels to bring these petitions to that to that together you may bring it all before our Lord and Saviour Jesus Christ. He who is love and mercy cannot refuse such a wonderful stepfather and such a mother as the Blessed Virgin Mary. I ask for your help and your protection in everything I say, everything I do and everything I am. Help me Saint Joseph, help me to be the man the husband and the father the Lord has called me to be. I pray that may sign my beautiful wife many, many, many beautiful, holy, blessed, virtuous, healthy, holy, beautiful, wonderful, holy, saintly, mighty, humble, holy, beautiful, wonderful, healthy children, physically, mentally, emotionally, spiritually. By the power of the Holy Spirit in Jesus Christ's name, and grant us the grace, the gift, the miracle to always be able to provide and then physically, mentally, emotionally, spiritually, by the power of the Holy Spirit in Jesus Christ's name. I beg thee, Saint Joseph, to help my family of all our worries, all our troubles, all our concerns, and of all the people who pray and ask for your intercession before our Lord and Saviour Jesus Christ. And let me make this clear to those people who accuse Catholics or worshipping Mary and angel saints. We are nothing but dust, and even Joseph and Mary, they'll be the first to say we are nothing but dust before our Lord and Saviour Jesus Christ. But you cannot take from Saint Joseph that he was the stepfather and is the stepfather of Jesus Christ, the second person of the Holy Trinity, as you cannot take away that Mary is the mother of our Lord and Saviour Jesus Christ. Do you not think that they are before our Lord and Saviour Jesus Christ now, in His presence in heaven, where else would they be? And we ask for their intercession for us now. Pray for us, Saint Joseph. Pray for us, Blessed Virgin Mary. 
as you stand before our Lord Jesus Christ always. Hear our prayers. I ask you to help me, St. Joseph. Help me, please. Help our family. Help the families and the people who ask for your intercession. For we are surely in need of your help and the help of your protection over the whole church in these evil and dark times. Believe in God the Father, the Almighty, the Creator of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, His only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the power of the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died and was buried, descended into hell. And on the third day He arose again, He ascended into heaven, and is seated at the right hand of God the Father, the Almighty. From thence He shall come to judge the living and the dead, believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church the communion of the saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and the life everlasting. Amen. Pray now, Father, free Hail Mary's and the glory be for the Pope's intentions, and the work supernatural increase in faith, hope, and charity. Pray for any plenty of partial indulgence again from this day and every day, and our past, our present, and the future, so souls may be saved, that punishment may be removed in the mercy of Jesus Christ, our Lord. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and fear us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us, Lord, from every evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou, most and blessed is the fruit of thy own Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou, most and blessed is the fruit of thy own Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Pray the joyful mysteries. First joyful mystery is the Annunciation. I am the handmaid of the Lord, that we have said, Be done unto me, the Blessed Virgin Mary. Perfectly answered the call of the angel and answered and responded to our Lord and was filled with the Holy Spirit who overshadowed her and she conceived Jesus Christ, our Lord. As Saint Joseph accepted Mary and loved her and took her as his wife, even though she was pregnant, how hard this must have been for him when he didn't understand this. But the angel told him to take her as his wife. For this is a, this is what this is an act of God that she is pregnant, or she is carrying God Himself. Let us have. A heart like Joseph to always do the will of God, even when we don't understand what God is doing. Ya tocó la siete, hoy atro siete, hoy atro marchatro, hoy la siete, hay atro sayata, hoy la siete yashata. Saint Teresa of Avila, she says. In the book of her life, in chapter 6, I took from my advocate and Lord the glorious Saint Joseph and earnestly recommended myself to him. And before I continue, I'm just going to say that in this language, Saint Teresa is calling Saint Joseph like a Lord and Savior. She means Lord in the sense of Master, as a servant says, Master. And this is the context for those people who may say, Oh, she's calling Joseph her Lord. Yes, but in the sense of a, a servant and their master. She continues, I saw clearly that, as in this need, so in other greater ones, concerning honour and loss of soul, this father and lord of mine came to my rescue in better ways than I knew how to ask for. I don't recall up to this day ever having petitioned him for anything that he failed to grant. It is an amazing thing the great many favours that God has granted me through the meditation of this blessed saint. 
the dangers I was freed from both of body and soul. Grant us the same intercession of Saint Joseph, Lord Holy Spirit, as he petitions for us before Jesus Christ at this very moment. Grant us, Lord, a heroic supernatural increase in all the graces, gifts, fruits, consolations, virtues, charisms, gifts, fruits, consolations, virtues, beatitudes of the Holy Spirit, faith, hope, and charity. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us, Lord, from every evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women. Blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women. Blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women. Blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women. Blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, as now and ever shall be, world of our end. Amen. O oh, my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most in need of thy mercy. Amen. The second joyful mystery is a visitation. My soul magnifies the Lord, my spirit rejoices in God, my Saviour. Let us have a heart like the Blessed Virgin Mary, rejoicing in all the wonders that the Lord and Saviour Jesus Christ does for us. What a great blessing it was for the Blessed Virgin Mary to have such a just and holy husband as Saint Joseph. Saint Teresa of Avila in the Book of Her Life speaking of her maiden of Saint Joseph, says, It is an amazing thing, the great many favours God has granted me through the mediation of this blessed saint, the dangers I was freed from both of body and soul. For with other saints it seems the Lord has given him grace to be of help in one need, whereas with this glorious saint I have experienced that he helps in all our needs, and that the Lord wants us to understand that just as he was subject to Saint Joseph on earth, for since being for since bearing the title of father, being the Lord's tutor, Joseph could give the child command, so in heaven God does whatever he commands. So we ask you, Saint Joseph, that you may pray for us before our Lord and Saviour Jesus Christ and ask 
for the graces, the gifts and the failures that we need at this very moment and for our lives. Again, how can the Lord Jesus Christ refuse such a wonderful stepfather as you? If what we ask, ask is in accordance with God's will for our soul and the souls of others, how can the Lord refuse you? Grant us, Lord, heroic supernatural increase and in all the graces, gifts, fruits, consolations, carousels, fruits, consolations, virtues, beatitudes of the Holy Spirit, heroic supernatural increase in faith, hope and charity. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, for us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us, Lord, from every evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Now and at the hour of our death, Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Now and at the hour of our death, Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Now and at the hour of our death, Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world of our end. Amen. O oh, my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those who most in need of thy mercy. Amen. O The third joyful mystery is the birth of our Lord and Saviour Jesus Christ. The Word became flesh and dwelt amongst us. And how wonderful it must have been for Saint Joseph, the stepfather of Jesus, to see the King of Kings, the Lord of Lords, being born in a manger to see he who is God as a little baby infant. Oh, what joy it must have been for Saint Joseph to hold the blessed child, the King of Kings, to hold this little one close to him, holding him protecting the little child Jesus in his human nature. You ask you Saint Joseph through your intercession that you may protect us and hold us close to your strong chest as you held close the little child Jesus protecting us from the attacks and snares of the evil one physically mentally, emotionally, spiritually and bring us always to the safe port of Jesus Christ our Lord and Saviour. 
grant us, Lord, a heroic supernatural increase in all the graces, gifts, fruits, consolations, virtues, charisms, gifts, fruits, consolations, virtues, beatitudes of the Holy Spirit, faith, hope, and charity. St. Teresa of Avila, she says, speaking of St. Joseph in the book of her life in chapter 6, because of my impressive experience of the goods this glorious saint obtains from God, I had a desire to persuade all to be devoted to him. I have not known anyone truly devoted to him and rendering him special services who has not advanced more in virtue. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and fear us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us, Lord, from every evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou, most women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou, most women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those who are most in need of thy mercy. Amen. Oyatro mashatro, koda siete, ayatro masyata, koda siete, oyatro ya siete. The fourth joyful mystery is the presentation of our Lord and Saviour Jesus Christ in the temple. Our Lord was presented before Simeon. And he said, A sword shall pierce your own heart to the Blessed Virgin Mary. How strange these words must have seemed to Saint Joseph. He who so dearly always wants to protect the Blessed Virgin Mary and the little child Jesus. Hearing that a sword shall pierce her heart. Oh, I wonder how Saint Joseph would have felt. How he must have prayed to our Heavenly Father that he should always protect his beloved wife Mary and the little child Jesus. Grant us, Lord. His protection and His love. He who desires that all souls love His beloved stepson, Jesus Christ, King of Kings, Lord of Lords. Saint Teresa of Avila, in chapter six of uh, the Book of Her Life, says, speaking of Saint Joseph, for in a powerful way He benefits souls who recommend, recommend themselves to Him. Also, she speaks of like those of us maybe who pray for wrong things. She says, it seems to me that for some years now I have asked him for 
something on his feast day and my petition was always granted. If the request is somewhat out of line, he rectifies it for my greater good. So even when we ask for something wrong, St. Joseph brings that petition before our Lord in, in a way that obtains what is good and what is best for us and, and our neighbour. Grant us, Lord, a heroic supernatural increase in all the graces, gifts, fruits, consolations, virtues, charisms, gifts, fruits, consolations, virtues, beatitudes of the Holy Spirit, faith, hope, and charity. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and fear us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And it is known of temptation, but deliver us, Lord, from every evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women. Blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women. Blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women. Blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women. Blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, now and it shall be, world for our end. Amen. O oh, my Jesus, fear us for sin, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls into heaven above especially those who are most in need of thy mercy. Amen. Ko ya sheti ya truma siyata ko la siyata ya sheti o ya shatru ko ya sheti O la shatro masyete. The fifth joyful mystery is the joy I find in our Lord and Saviour Jesus Christ in the temple. When the little child Jesus was found in the temple, and um, Mary and Joseph were obviously a bit troubled, wondering where he was. Did you not know that? Your father and I were worried about you. And Jesus says, Did you not know I was about my father's business? How mysterious these words would have been, being about his father's business. St. Joseph must have been puzzled by these words, as Our Lady was puzzled. But I'm sure, like the Blessed Virgin Mary, as it said in the scripture, he pondered and treasured these words of our Lord, not knowing fully what they meant. Grant us the grace to trust in our Heavenly Father and in our Lord Jesus, by the power of the Holy Spirit, three persons and one, the many mysteries of our Lord, yet yeah. Let us love him even when we don't understand why God does or doesn't do things in our lives and the lives of our loved ones. Let us always place our trust in him as St. Joseph always does.
centuries of child, uh, centuries of Avila in the book of her life in chapter 6 says I only ask for the love of God those who do not believe me to try and they will see through experience the great good that comes from recommending oneself to this glorious patriarch and being devoted to him especially persons of prayer should always be attached to him for I don't know how one can think about the Queen of Angels and about when she went through so much with the infant Jesus without giving thanks to Saint Joseph for the good assistance he then provided them both with. Those who cannot find a master to teach them prayer should take this glorious saint for their master and they will not go astray. Grant us, Lord, the works, supernatural increase, and all the graces, gifts, fruits, consolations, virtues, charisms, gifts, fruits, consolations, virtues, beatitudes of the Holy Spirit, works, supernatural increase, in faith, hope, and charity. Saint Joseph, pray for us. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, for us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us, Lord, from every evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women. Blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women. Blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women. Blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Now and at the hour of our death, Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women. Blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Now and at the hour of our death, Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women. Blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Now and at the hour of our death, Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women. And blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world for end. Amen. Hail, Holy Queen, hail our life, our sweetness, and our hope. To thee do we cry, poor banished children of Eve. To thee do we send up our sighs, mourning and weeping in this valley of tears. Turn, the most gracious advocate, the lands of mercy toward us, and after this our exile, show unto us the blessed fruits of thy womb, Jesus. O Clement, O loving God, sweet Virgin Mary, pray for us, most holy Mother of God, that we may wear the promise of Christ. Saint Michael the Archangel, defend us in battle. Be our protection against the wickedness and snares of the devil. May God rebuke him, we humbly pray. And do thou, Prince of the Heavenly Host, by the power of God, thrust and tell Satan and all the evil spirits who prowl about the world, seeking the ruin of souls. The most sacred heart of Jesus, have mercy on us. The most sacred heart of Jesus, have mercy on us. The most sacred heart of Jesus, have mercy on us. The immaculate heart of Mary, pray for us. Good Saint Joseph, pray for us. All you angels and saints, pray for us. Souls and purgatory, pray for us as we pray for you. Viva Saint Joseph. Viva San Jose. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen.